Google's new AI tool for writing is insane. It's called TextFX and I got a little nervous when I opened the site because I saw this list of tools and it made me wonder, is AI getting good at clever copywriting and wordsmithing? That has been one of the main things that I think is holding AI back from taking over creative copywriting jobs. But as I got into it, I was no longer nervous, just excited. All of the tools in here are going to be incredible resources for creative writing. Things that I would normally be spending hours researching and digging into are instantly available with these tools. Let me show you. So I think one of the most useful tools on here is going to be POV. I think this is going to be super useful for finding insights and different positions or angles on things. So for this one, I tried typing in succulents and what's cool is underneath it says temperature and that you can take from super direct and straightforward to crazy. And here's some of the things that it popped out saying succulents are the hipster's pet rock. That's a really fun place to start creatively. Your succulents are the only plants that can survive in a college dorm room. That'd be a great campaign starter to target college students. Another one I could see myself using all the time is the unfold tool. And this one basically gives you idioms, phrases, compound words, anything that involves the word that you type in. So here I tried typing in the word shoe and I got a couple different phrases and things related to shoes. So shoestring budget, stepping into someone else's shoes, walking a mile in someone's shoes, all awesome things that I can go write some copy with. Unexpect is another awesome tool that I think would be really helpful for things that are using humor or long form writing that needs a little bit more narrative. For this one, I just typed a baby's nursery because my baby was sitting in front of me when I was doing this. And a baby nursery filled with a variety of exotic snakes is definitely unexpected. But my favorite output of this was a nursery decorated with nothing but pictures of Nicolas Cage. Next baby, we're definitely doing that. So they partnered with Lupe Fiasco to show how a lot of these can be used with rap and songwriting. They have videos on there of him actually going through these tools which is really cool to see. So those are just a few of the tools on there. I cannot wait to keep digging into this and trying it out in my own work. I've spent so much time using a bunch of other sites researching word associations, rhymes, idioms, phrases, anything I can use to give me some creative fodder to write with. And I can see this becoming my go-to tool. Go check it out and tell me what you think. I'm so excited about this.